Lawyers from Columbus law firms will be among the thousands of cyclists and volunteers who will participate in Pelotonia, a three-day bike tour to raise funds for cancer research. I was first diagnosed with cancer over 14 years ago. We became involved initially because one of our partners um, was going through cancer um, treatment. Everybody here in one way or the other has been affected by cancer. I had four friends who had breast cancer. The firm as an organization believes in the uh, in the cause. In my mind, there's no ch better charity to, uh, to participate in. Since the event began four years ago, the five firms combined have raised more than $400,000. There's a lot of emotion associated with this ride, and everybody's just in really high spirits. Uh, you see cancer survivors, you know, thanking you for the fundraising. You, you see survivors riding. You see people that are going through cancer right now riding. People who line the course that have signs up, thanks for saving my mom. When you're really in the midst of the whole ride and you think about why you're there, it gives you extra adrenaline. It gives us an opportunity as a group to participate in something outside the office uh, that is community-based and can't think of a better cause. Volunteers from the firms will also be busy passing out water and helping with food service for all those hungry cyclists. It's fantastic. I mean, you see all the riders come through and uh, you get to support all the riders and cheer them on as they come through. Pelotonia does a fantastic job of providing an awesome experience for the riders and for the volunteers. So it's, it's, it's a good cause and it's also a lot of fun. The Sweat and Gasp Up Hills is a lot of fun and it's, it's honestly helped us uh, to uh, you know, just find a better better connection amongst ourselves. Good friend Tom Lodge, close friend, law partner, uh, many people I've known have gone through treatment at the James and have benefited from it. Uh, and you know, this is a chance to give back a little bit to the community. And all of us at the Ohio State Bar Association wish the riders a safe trip.